They're decent. Here they are. Boom. See you later, bitch. Later, bitch. It does look like the, the longer you are on the horse, the faster he starts running. That's pretty interesting. Shit, fuck, two people. Let's fucking kill these guys. I was pressing the wrong cooldown. Oh, Jesus. What's that? What's he doing? Oh, he's blocking. Woo, titty. What's going on, guys? Welcome back to another video. Welcome to... Elbion Online. Holy fuck, let's try the shit out of this game. So I have no clue what this game is like. I know it is a, a, a clicker. You gotta click the wall, kind of like Diablo. I'm not sure how it works from there, but uh, let's go and figure it out. Another survivor. Yes. We are in this together. Climb the lighthouse, look for the ship, check the bridge for enemies, return to the wounded crafter. Alright. So I don't know if any of you have been playing uh, the Diablo games, but that's definitely fucking... Looks a lot like this so far. I recommend it too. It's very good. Alright, so there are enemies. Alright, go back to the stairs. And let's go ahead and tell it to the wounded... The wounded craftsman. F is sprint, huh? We're gonna have to change that. You're doing great. You're my right hand. All right. First of all, how do I go to tools? Yes, game settings, uh, key bindings. What is left shift? Because F is not gonna work for me. F ain't gonna work for me. Let's see. It's just selecting party members, interfaces, and shit. Mouse control. What's F then? Alright, looks like I don't have any choice in the matter. <laughs> okay. This kind of looks like RuneScape too. God, I fucking played that game so much. <laughs> don't know if you guys have been playing any RuneScape, but... Uh, God, that game... That game, I spent some hours into that one. Alright, let's return to the wounded crafter and let's go and see what this motherfucker can do for me. Alright, let's go and craft some armor and some weapons. Alright, check our inventory. Ooh, we got a beginner sword. Spells can be selected by opening item detail. Oh, wait. Deals 116 physical damage to an enemy, creates an heroic charge on you. Each heroic charge increases your move and attack speed. Or, your physical damage to all enemies. So, this is AoE. Let's go ahead and pick that one. So far, so good. There is no time to waste. I got a shield too. Can you also do that with shields then? No. Alright, so let's go and fight these fucking enemies, see what we can make happen. There we go. What do you got? Yeah. Oh, sweet. Easy does it, baby. The destiny board consists of nodes. Nodes show the progressation and skills of your character. 
Unlock nodes by gaining fame. There's combat fame earned by defeating enemies. Gathering fame is gathering resources. Gathering uh, crafting fame is from crafting, etc. Okay. Track. Okay, progress. Okay. So this is not going very fast. All right, so we got this one. All right, do any activities, defeat any enemies to gain fame. All right, so far so good. So we just arrived in the hideout and um, see what we can make happen here. All right, so these are a lot of players already. It seems, it's pretty fucking active. Bloody good work. Go to the marketplace, all right? I have lots to trade. All right, so I got 15 shillings, so I'm able to buy a horse. My pleasure. Go into my inventory, reach into my horse pocket. And that will be A. Let's do. Oh, our quest was uh, find the wounded crafter in the hideout. Oh, so we are in the hideout, so we just got to figure out where that wounded crafter is, huh? Oh, there he is. That's my boy. You handled yourself well, friend. Thanks, you mate. Get another quest. You must acquire a beginner's pickaxe, and you must acquire a beginner's axe. All right, so let's craft that. We don't have enough materials. So first, we got to go ahead and figure out where we're going to get those materials. Mm, I can't go here yet. Doesn't look like I've unlocked it yet. Not there either. Oh, here's where we can gather materials. Nice. Big tree. I think we gotta go ahead and collect six of each again. Decent. So I think I should have enough now. Good day. So I got a beginner's and a beginner's axe. Oh. Alright, so we got it. You know what to do. Open the world map by pressing the button of using the hotkeys. Alright. This is the world map. Here you can find information about the whole continent of Elbion. Okay. Alright. Show which resources, yeah, okay. Spawn, mm -hmm. Basic information. Go into the forest. Alright, so we're gonna go into the forest and... <clears throat> see where we can, uh... See what we can go ahead and do. So I've heard a lot about this game, and that really got me curious on trying it out. Alright. Find and gather some birch logs. Oh, that takes long, but you'll get 50 from it. Holy. Sweet. There's one. Take the D. Got him, baby. Ooh, nine rugged leather. Jesus. What are these rough logs? What's this one? So do we have an experience bar somewhere or don't? Alright, decent, decent. Alright. 
All right, so we did gather the birch logs. So this is this one. So let's go ahead and collect that one again. Booyah. So now we should be able to return to Silas pretty easily. This game does seem to be very active, so that is definitely a lot of fun. So far, this is the type of game that would probably get me hooked for the first few months. And hope to keep me there, obviously. Alright, so let's go ahead and return to Silas, my boy! My boy Silas! Go into the mountain and gather ore and fiber. Alright, sir, we will do that. Going into the mountain. So guys, if you're enjoying this game, don't forget to like, comment, or subscribe if you haven't done so already. And uh, if you want to let me know, you should definitely, uh, you should definitely uh, let me know in the comments. So far, this game does seem like a lot of fun, and uh, let's just hope it will stay that way. This is, uh, by the way, a game I'll be playing a little bit uh, for Time to Kill. Might play it some more in my free time, but. Um, before that, I'm probably just gonna go ahead and do it till uh, Outer Worlds comes out. Out of motherfucking worlds. Which does seem like a really good game. So you can't sprint on your donkey. <laughs> it does look more like a donkey than it looks like a horse, but I'll take it. I'll take it. What should we name him? Yes, definitely. Alright, so we just got a copper bar. That seems like the excused cloth guy. The smell. You're excused. Craftsman duty fulfilled. One step at a time. Oh wait, I still have to go to the Lumbridge Lumber Mill refined to birch logs into birch planks. Wow. And that's this guy? Okay. Alright, so we just did that. Talk to her and do this. Alright, so now huge birch planks to repair the ship. Okay. So the ship is right there. Alright. So we just repaired the ship. That's fucking sweet, baby. Let's go and talk again to uh, this fella. Speak with Captain Tia in the hideout. Where is Captain Tia? Oh, she should be in the middle? Here. There she is. How do I get the... Okay. Chief Lutz again. The tides have turned. Go to the outpost and steal a heretic map. You've gained a learning point. Learning point threshold. The line in the progress bar indicates a learning point threshold. <laughs> Once the line is passed, learning points can be used. All right, 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 right. Well then, let me pick a point. How do I do that? How do I pick a point? How do I get back into the menu? Oh well. I guess I'll figure it out later a bit. Maybe you gotta do it in here. No, doesn't look like it. Okay, no idea. Let's go ahead and head to the... To the hideout then. It does look like the, the longer you are on the horse, the faster he starts running. That's pretty interesting. Shit, fuck, two people. Just fucking kill these guys. Pressing the wrong cooldown. Oh, Jesus. What's that? What's he doing? Oh, he's blocking. Woot! 
city. Now give me your loot. That's what I'm saying, baby. This guy might need some help. There you go, bud. Got you back. So I'm really curious what this game more has to offer than just questing. Later, bitch. Later, bitch. Kill the heretics until you have learned the healing point threshold. Oh shit. Uh, boom. Ooh, titty. learning point threshold. So when do you know when you've learned that? Just out of curiosity, asking for a friend. Boom, baby. That's how you do it. That's how you do it, baby. Let's go. Alright. Learning point reached. Sweet. Reaching the learning point threshold of the combat node. So am I allowed to do it now or what? Learn. Yes. Alright. Now we gotta return to Captain TT. And uh, show her how it's done. Is that the health of my horse? Are they able to kill him? They are! Listen, here you go, fuckface. Nobody kills my horse, Betty! Oh, I gotta cough. There's only one solution not to cough, then. Ah, that's good stuff. Haha, <laughs> later, bitch! So that's how we do it, baby. I still got a cough. Oh my god, I don't wanna. So if, I'm curious, have you guys played other um, MMOs? What's your favorite MMO you've probably played? Uh, mine's definitely gotta be World of Warcraft. I do think that is probably one of the most fun MMOs I've ever played. I have been playing a lot of League of Legends lately. Uh, I have not really tried World of Warcraft Classic simply because it doesn't really interest me that much. It doesn't really interest me that much. So now we're just gonna go ahead and head back here and talk to Captain That's TT. What I'm talking about. Come back when you're ready. All right, what you wear? Go to the Warrior's Forge. Uh, which one is that? It's this one. Oh, Warrior's Forge. All right, so it looks like we gotta collect copper bars in order to get armor. So this is rough stone. Hello, adventure. Hello. Go to the hunter's lodge and see what you can craft there. Well, it doesn't look like I can craft anything. All right, so copper bars, we need to go ahead and collect more rough stone. So let's go ahead and quickly do that and then head back into, uh, back into that mob bucket. We'll see you guys in a bit. All right, so we just uh, crafted a bunch of iron bars, so I do think we should be able to collect all this armor now. See if we can make it happen with it. Oh shit, we got a helmet, babe. Whew. All right, so what are we gonna take? As long as you are not in combat, you can heal. 
Unleashed fear. Once unleashed, you get 7% damage. Ooh, that sounds good. Oh, that sounds real good. Sprint. And you can carry 12 more kilos. Sweet. Alright. That was pretty fucking nice. So let's go ahead and craft good. the Novice Sword as well. And with the Novice Shield. Oh, we don't have enough logs for that. Okay. We need uh, refined logs. Let's go ahead and stick with uh, the Stabby Stab. Because it does seem really good. Let's go ahead and quickly... And uh, refine the wood. I think he did that with this guy. He did not. He did it with this guy. Yes. Oh, I need birch locks for that, which I don't have. All right. So for now, I do think this uh, this is gonna be it for the, this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. And if you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like, comment, or sub down below. And I do think we'll be uh, playing this game again. See you guys later. Until the next one. Peace.